is one of my favorite 3ds games behind like ocarina of time and majora's mask like the remade versions um i remember beating this game quite a few times when i was younger i'm gonna go ahead and continue this and i have 63 lives so it's been like quite a while since i've actually died in this game i guess since it's so it's so much easier compared to like when i was younger and i didn't really know how to play or whatever probably find like a few lives in this so i think oh no this is like one of the box upgrades you can get oh okay as soon as i got it i messed it up all right it's fine okay this is like uh, this should be the first star point here i think that's what they're called Okay, oh no, what? How's that already the second one? I just started. Oh, let me go back. Okay, so the third one's right here. Yeah, this almost seems pretty short so far. Oh, I'm running out of time already? What the heck? Oh, let me just go ahead and skip. That's weird. I never really run out of time in this game. <clears throat> okay, that's like the first time I've gotten like the timer thing. Okay, there's some clocks right here. Let me just get these. Oh, am I gonna get the gold? Uh, I need to get the gold um, flag thing. I'm not gonna make it. I need to get that box or the the Mario leaf. I forgot what it was called. I can't believe we ran out of time. Or almost ran out of time. I think you can get like one coin from your theme. Okay, yeah. Um, you do get one coin for these boxes. I completely forgot about that. I thought it was just like an item, but I think that's the Toad House that gives you items. Okay, I'm kind of stuck right here. What the heck? Okay, I, I, saw, I haven't played this game in a long time, but I don't remember. I think... I don't know if any like Mario. Okay, I know like a few Mario games. If you get all the coins, you do get something. Not, you don't really get something at the end of the game, right? But uh, I know you, uh, in this game, it's like a once you beat the game, there's like a like a different set of worlds you can go through. That's kind of a spoiler, but uh, I just remember like you would go through like different set of worlds in the like once you beat the game like fully or whatever. But I can't remember if it's you need to get all the coins or something else. Alright, we do that. Okay, I remember playing this when I was younger and I, for some reason I just thought it was way harder. But that one, yeah, these levels seem like they, they're getting shorter, kind of. Come on, no, I need to get that thing because I'm, I'm not really that good at like running and jumping perfectly at the top or whatever. 30 coins to unlock this little box. I think it's either, yeah, it's like, I think it's a Toad House or another level. But I have 57, so I have enough. <laughs> okay, that's another level. Okay, these ghost houses were kind of tricky when I was, oh, I remember the, not, well, they weren't that hard, but I remember they were kind of like a little bit difficult compared to like the normal levels. Okay, I do need this. Oh, actually, I hope I don't use. Oh, I might need it. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna need it for this level, but hopefully I don't die because I need it for. Oh shoot. Okay, pretty much any time it's like these little, these music little like blocks or whatever. It's always like a star level, or like an easy star point to get. Oh shoot! I almost messed that whole thing up. Okay, this should be the last one we're told. 
Or if not, it's oh yeah, it looked. Okay, look. Oh no, I literally. Oh my gosh, I ha I was about to get the gold flag. Oh. Okay, finally got the golden flag on this one. Oh, I call it golden, but it's pretty much just a yellow flag. Okay, finally got a yellow again. Oh, really? I don't know why I walked straight through him. I could have just jumped over him. Oh, I need this. I got a feather on uh, the... I call it feather even though it's a leaf. What the heck? Oh. Okay, I think I'm supposed to go back this way. Oh sure, I thought I was gonna die right there. Okay, this, the music in this level is pretty cool actually. Oh shoot, there's like a big ghost right behind me. Ah, uh, where am I supposed to go? Oh snap. Okay, I think this is the ending. Okay, I just wanted to take out that ghost real quick <laughs> with the start. Oh, I guess that's the last one. Okay, yeah. Uh, all the three stars and the yellow flag. This game is actually way easier than I remember. It's kind of crazy because I remember constantly dying like every level and getting game overs. Also, I was like in fourth or fifth grade when I played this. No, how did I fall? Seriously, like, like once you're like, like once you're in the air, you you can't quit the game. Really, I jumped right on that thing trying to kill the bee. Oh look, yeah, I remember this. If you die a whole bunch of if you die a lot, uh this game pretty much gives you like a a white and gold um I'm pretty sure it's called Tanuki Leaf and you can pretty much destroy everything in the way. Like you don't even have to touch it and it just dies. Which I always thought it was cheating when I was younger because like it just makes it too easy. And that's because the game is technically easy. But I'm just making like bad mistakes right now. But I'm not gonna use it, so I'm gonna go ahead and skip over that. And there's also another thing, if you keep dying like like constantly, like non-stop, you eventually get this thing, it's like P and it has an F on it. And I don't know why. Uh when I me and my siblings would call it like P flyer for some reason. But uh, it just says it's like a P and then it has a f like wings on it. I don't actually know what it is. I haven't like searched it up and or anything. But I pretty much just takes you to the very end of the level, which I always like. I never use it. I only use it once. 
I didn't like it because I just it felt like it was cheating because you're not actually playing the game. It was kind of funny that I thought like that when I was like small, like oh no, that thing's like too easy. What the heck? How am I supposed to do this? Oh, I got the gold, flag, a yellow flag without even. On my okay, I got the yellow flag on my first try, but I missed the first coin, first two coins. So we're at the final level with the Bowser ship. We're just like the final boss of every level is like either it's a castle or a ship. <coughs> <sighs> And I kind of don't like the auto scroll ones. Oh, most of these are auto scroll, like the ship. Oh shoot! What did I do? I instantly died. Can't believe I fell for that. Oh, that was all of them. That was pretty quick. Oh, actually, you know what? No, on some of these ship ones, it's not Bowser. You fight. You fight. Um. Like those, I don't know what they're called. They're not called Koopalings, but they're the, they're like turtles. It's either a girl turtle or a boy turtle. But yeah, these are pretty easy. Oh shoot, I don't remember doing, I don't remember this one doing that, what the heck? No, darn it. Yeah, this should be the last one. Oh, and it took damage somehow. Okay, yeah, so that was the final... That was just kind of like a mini boss for the level or whatever. Uh, okay, whatever. It's fine for now. Okay, so we're finally going to World 5. I'm going to go ahead and end the video off here. I want to thank everyone for watching. And I'll see you on another video.